after years of public outcry and concern, federal agents descended on the Houston Housing Authority's controversial 800 Middle Street project. Fox 26 political reporter Greg Rugan has been following this story on the front lines for us for the past two years. He's been all over this one. He's joining us now live from the East End here. Greg. Yeah, Anthony, the concern here has always been contamination and potential fraud and the ugly prospect of forcing poor families to move next door to toxic waste dumps. More than a dozen federal agents with local law enforcement in support serving a search warrant at 800 Middle Street, the Houston Housing Authority's highly controversial low-income project for 400 families. The $140 million complex is under heavy scrutiny because it's literally surrounded by toxic dump sites, an alarming fact first reported by Fox 26. It's important to remember they plan to put 400 low-income families here. That's six to 700 kids that are going to be playing in this neighborhood. Neighborhood activist Alan Atkinson has waged a five-year battle to expose the risk posed to residents. He believes both the Housing Authority and developer NRP lied to HUD about the amount and location of toxic waste in order to gain access to 54 million federal dollars to purchase the land. This afternoon, a drilling rig was deployed to the property directly bordering the complex. Atkinson is confident the test wells will reveal a clear and present danger. In certain areas, they're going to discover ash that's 22 feet deep. And this is ash that's highly toxic, created by the city of Houston incinerator property. That evidence could prove critical because HUD forbids construction of federal low-income housing within 3,000 feet of environmental hazards. And if it's proven that the information was suppressed to gain access to federal funding, criminal charges could follow. This is the worst place you could possibly build affordable housing, and they knew it privately behind the scenes. They knew it, and we have the documents that show they knew about this contamination. Ironically, this FBI raid took place about a quarter mile from the deadly helicopter tower crash, a tower which was also seen as a potential environmental hazard to 800 Middle Street. Meantime, we haven't heard from the Housing Authority, which consistently claims this place is safe to live in. For now, we're live on the East End. Greg Grugan, Fox 26 News.